Hey, what's up? So, I want to show you my new project that I'm working on. And this is an, actually a vacuum tube Tesla coil. Again, <laughs> there is the previous one. Um, it's a little bit smaller this time. Uh, but it has a quite special thingy here. <laughs> so, if you can see it. Um, the secondary coil actually is tuned by a capacitor or a bunch of capacitors in series. These are actually Russian doorknob caps. Uh, these are ceramic caps uh, with a voltage rating of about 15 kilovolts and 470 picofarad. These are 14 piece in series and so I get an absurd uh, voltage rating <laughs> and about I think 32 picofarad capacity so this capacitor actually acts as a top load for the secondary and in this case the secondary without the top load will have a resonant frequency at about uh, 3 megahertz I would say and uh, with these capacitors or this <laughs> imaginary top load it gets pushed down at about 900 kilohertz to about 1 megahertz I'm not really sure actually and yeah, this actually works pretty good and I just wanted to try this and wanted to see what happens. The secondary is actually wound with 1.32 millimeter thick wire. It's insulated wire. Um, yeah, here you see the primary coil, feedback coil, feedback system. I installed an ampere meter. It's a DC ampermeter, it's a little bit uh, unfortunate. <laughs> I had to build a circuit around it to read it really roughly, but it works. And yeah, built this element to cool down the tube. The tube is actually a Valvo TB4 1500. Unfortunately, this tube is uh, almost dead. It works pretty bad <laughs> at lower voltages it draws a lot of grid current and it, I think this tube is bad I didn't measure it right but uh, just from the feel um, yeah it just don't want to work like it, it used to but okay I get an output and I want to show you this it actually starts pretty smooth So I get a um, quite good output for the power draw. So the, um, the nah, I have two mods in series for the for the power for the plate voltage, and uh, these mods are actually don't really get warm, so it draws not that much, that much current, and I get an about I think. 50 to 60 centimeter output on Stancato. Oh, what's actually funny, if you can see this. <laughs> I get an arcing from the uh, anode. Uh, I think it's because of this really, really fins, uh, really big fins, uh, cooling fins. These are coupled capacitively into the air whatever <laughs> it works can make it a little bit darker It's super quiet, so it has a really, really warm sound. It didn't crack, so oh wait, something happens. Something cracked. <laughs> okay, I just turn it off. Better is. <laughs> These are the first test runs of this coil, 
I just wanted to show you guys how it operates. <laughs> yeah, I hope you like it and yeah, have a nice day. Bye bye.